Song of Songs 8, 7b. Im yitain ish et kol hon beto ba'ahava. Boz yavuzulo. We begin here with this if. Now we're picking up in the middle of the verse, but uh, certainly an independent clause here. If a man would give. Now you might hear the would give. Here the verbal root is natan. It's a call imperfect third masculine singular with man here as the subject. And the if here provides that kind of hypothetical situation. And so if a man would give is, is fitting, I think. If a man would give, direct object marker here, all the wealth of his house, all the wealth of his house. And then we get this interesting bait preposition on love. And uh, several of the lexica will mention that yitain or natan plus the direct object plus the bait preposition will often mean that this bait preposition is functioning as uh, exchange or purchase. So the idea here is if a man would exchange all of the wealth of his house for love, for love, or in exchange for love. So bait preposition might feel a little bit odd there if we're going to try to say in, with, at, or something like that. Um, but the uh, the lexica do attest to natan plus the bait in this context of purchase or something like that. Next we get an infinitive absolute of the verbal root bait vav zion to be despised, followed immediately by the imperfect third masculine plural of the same verbal root. Now this is the scenario that we would have as a cognate accusative or uh, what we might call an absolute object. And the idea is being despised, they would despise him. They would despise him. And so this is a way of saying, it's a very strong statement, this is a way of saying he would be he would be utterly despised, or if we stick to the third masculine plural verb here, they, the proverbial they, they would utterly despise him.